He's holy. He's separated. There is no shadow of turning, no shadow of wavering. He's the same yesterday, today, and forever. Traditions can change. Culture can change. People can change. But God will remain the same. And you will always have the same one seated at his right hand who is our king and high priest. He will have that position forever. And as the scripture says, of his kingdom there shall be no end. So when you take this word and you read it, you can bank on it. It ain't going to change. Everything else will change, but this word is not going to change. God is not going to bend his will to fit a cultural society that doesn't think that they need him. He's not, you can't do without me. You are not going to make it without me. And listen, let me tell you something else. The world is not going to end by climate change. That ain't how things wrap up. Read your Bible. You'll find out exactly how things are going to end up. And it don't say in the end that because of climate change, because the earth has gotten so warm, because the icebergs have melted and floods are all over the place. No, God's not going to flood the earth out anymore. But what he is coming with is a purifying fire, consuming fire. And if you're not careful, you will get burned. Amen. As straight from the throne of God and from his word. He's not going to change that for any culture, any society. It doesn't matter how advanced we become in technology or any other type of thing. It doesn't matter how, well, you know, we are, we, we, we are we're better off now. We are much smarter than generations prior to us. And God is saying, you're still as dumb. As a matter of fact, you're dumber than dumber than dumb. With all of this education you got, you, it, it's not bringing you to the place that you need to come to. 